Hey guys, Alexei from Ace 5 Studios, and here I show you how to use my characters with the Mixamo motion clip library thingy. So the first thing you do is you want to unlock your joint and mesh layer, you want to make your joint layer visible, you select this jacket tie thing, you middle click on it, and here in the coordinates manager you press unfreeze all, so all these things at the bottom are zero. Now you grab this and you copy it, so you press Ctrl C, you press Ctrl N to make a new file, and you press Ctrl V to paste them in. Now delete the accessories, the mesh, and the control tab. So now you have jacket and then you have joints underneath. This is important, it has to be the structure. And then you go file, export, and call it, it's an FBX, and call it John Suit Mix Ammo, and press OK. And here I recommend version 7.4 of BX, not all these versions work with Mix Ammo for some reason. Turn off cameras, the rest I think you can leave as this. Press OK. And then you wanna to go to the Mix Ammo website, and you go upload a character and you open your folder where you saved your character, uh, John Suit Mixamo, and you drag and drop it here, and it will upload. And it doesn't always work. Ah. And there you have it. You have the character uploaded. If it doesn't work straight away, just drag and drop it again. It's what I just did, and it seems to have fixed it. <laughs> so, yeah, it seems to be they're not always happy with the up with the upload. Anyway, so you press next, and you say next, and then you find animation. So we can pick standing up, or hip hop dancing. I think hip hop dancing works pretty well. Or quarterback pass. I don't know. Pick whatever you like, and then you press download, and you press download. And you save it once it appears as quarterback pass and you press save. Then in your Cinema 4D, you go back to your full file and you go file and merge and you get quarterback pass and you press okay. Uh, nope. And now you can see here the animation of your joints. Should probably double click this. There you go, and you have a pass there. So, uh, you right click on this jacket tie, you go to character tags, and you press pose morph. And here you take hierarchy, rotation, and you go back and you take position, and you go tag. And then here, in target, you drag this jacket tie into here. And that's not really exactly how it was meant to work. Ah yes, because you have to delete your control tags, there you go. And then you have your animation. You can go filter and turn off joints if you don't want to see them. Joints. And there you have it. Don't forget to delete the control group. Or if the control group, if you want to keep it for later, you can always um, just disable all the undo here. If you select, not here, in the joints, if you select all of these, um, tags and you can disable them, but you also have to remember to unfold and select everything inside. So basically it's just easy to delete the control tag. And that's it. And then you have your motion cut for animation. There. Hope you enjoy that. If you have any questions, just ask. Also, don't forget to check my website for more tutorials, more guides, more stock figures. These guys, if you don't know, are my 5J character pack, which you can buy from ace5studio.com forward slash 5J. And yeah. I have a good day.